So, ever bought a brand new product and it was perfect in every single way? And it did everything you could have ever dreamed of? Well, that was me until two weeks ago. So I want to preface this by actually saying that I need help. I need your help because why on earth does my MacBook screen keep going black? Now, after many calls to Apple support, I need to fix this problem because it is driving me insane. So first off, is it possible that products, electric products can actually go into shock? Because I recently moved from 90 degree weather to 110 degree weather all in a space of 24 hours. Now, when I did this move, I was thinking to myself, oh my God, my body is going to go into shock because how can you possibly prepare for getting on a plane in flip-flops and coming out with 10 layers? So I thought I would freeze to death, but it turns out that it was my laptop that actually went into said shock. Now, after I landed in this icy weather, I was like, okay, I'm going to cozy up in bed and I went straight into binging The Flash. Yes, The Flash. I was about five episodes in and my screen just went black no warning no nothing i did what any reasonable person would do i plugged it in i was like my battery is dead and i was like hold up it was a hundred percent two hours ago and there's no possible way that would change that fast also there was this weird halo thing that was happening to the screen it was sort of like i could still see like the people moving behind the screen and it was like this light dark shadows moving around i could still pause and play the video i just couldn't see the video so i had to reboot the laptop and i was like okay it was weird but let's get back to business went straight back into my tv show binge session and boom two hours later it goes off again so suffice to say this little glitch of mine has actually been happening at least once a day since i got here which is about a week and a couple of days. Now, before all of you decide to get your knickers all in a twist, here's what I've tried. I did everything from booting up in safe mode. I did the whole fast aid thingy stuff that people talk about. I ran diagnostics. I even did that thing, you know, where you check for like hardware issues, all clean, by the way. I even got on the phone with Apple support for one and a half hours and they still couldn't figure out what's wrong. They're like, hold up, your system seems to be functioning like, perfect but this little thing that's happening to you we can't really figure it out they were like okay let's get back and look into it and they're gonna get back to me later but they probably think i need to go to a physical upper to actually get it fixed now this feels oddly familiar if any one of you actually watched my last video you would know that i actually went to the exact same thing with my pixel 7 it was perfect until it wasn't same thing with my laptop it was perfect until it wasn't. So now aside from feeling like the world's unluckiest person, I actually really want to figure out what's going on. I don't particularly do anything heavy with my laptop, especially in the past couple of weeks, I've been swamped with this big move. But honestly, I just, I just need help figuring, figuring it out. All I do on my computer is basically like run so many documents, just typing things away, I'm doing some lessons in my programming classes. I am watching videos, listening to Spotify. That's pretty much all I do all day. So what exactly is causing this? I am coming to you guys for some support. Right now, you are the elves over at the workshop. I just, I need to figure this out because if this keeps happening, I am going to lose my mind. Now, since you guys have proven to be rather helpful lately some of you have given me some really cool ideas on stuff over the past couple of weeks on different things that i've experienced i present this issue to you i need help figuring this out my threshold for dealing with petty annoyances is very low on a regular basis and this has reached its limit this is to stop guys so if any of you can actually hazard a guess as to what's causing this issue with my macbook please drop it down in the comments. I am eager to see if you guys come up with something I haven't thought of. And please be prepared for many, 
many follow-up questions from me. I need your help, please. So there you have it, guys. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Also, like and subscribe. That usual stuff. Thank you.